Hey hey and welcome back to Colored Creations and another flip through of the pages I have completed so far in my anti-journal. If you are interested in seeing my previous flip through or one of the um, other videos I made in my with my anti-journal, um, I leave some kind of annotation or card or something in this general area here for you to click. Um, so today to just um, uh, be a bit random, I'm gonna start from the back side. I've marked the pages I'm going to show you with paper clips because uh, some of them are work in progress. The first one I have completed is um, collage the patterns from inside of used envelopes. And I did so. I might add some more because this area is pretty boring, but yeah. And then two prompts in one page. It says subtle difference, differences in color. So I just made some kind of yellow evolution thingy. And here is the sign transparently refle reflect light. And I made a the Deathly Hallow symbol in plastic. And then I just used double-sided tape or adhesive to add it to the page. So both the plastic will reflect light and the adhesive as well. If you might hear something walking around, yeah. it is this little person, I was going to say, uh, who thinks it's weird when I talk to myself. Um, yeah, let's get back to the anti-journal. So the next spread I've done is this one. It says use a pencil in an unusual way. And what I did is um, I simply just used it as a stamp, I would say. This is not the pen I used, but um, the pen holder thingy. My English as, is as usual excellent. I used this one to stamp the stamps of the flowers and it was some kind of a rubber grip part and that's the small squares you see all over the place. And for the flower and petals I used um, some kind of a eraser protection thingy that was on top. So yeah, quite an unusual way. And then the prompt was repeat a positive statement over and over and I just wrote every cloud has a silver lining um, just over and over and over and then it was dump negativity and I just wrote down some stuff will, that will pop into my mind from time to time. And the next one was Take the long route from here to here, and as you can see, I just um, drew a line in the biggest space available. And in the beginning, uh, I was um, pretty particular, and <laughs> in the end, I was quite bored, so the line gets a bit more squiggly and uneven. The next prompt I finished was phone someone you haven't spoken to for a while, doodle while you talk. And I wasn't actually talking to someone, but I was waiting in, uh, in line, a phone queue. Um, so I just doodled some stuff, there's a human eye, a dog eye, two raccoons, some kind of penguin owly thingies, some doodling, an owl, half an owl, um, toothless from How to Train a Dragon, and Stitch, and a Minion, and some shading practicing. And then we have this spread, which you might have seen if you watch my anti-journal video number two. I took a walk with my dog, and it says record a walk in images or objects. And if you click on this page, it will take you to the video, if you want to see that. And then we have, let's see now, sorry, just the, the last one that I've complete. no, 
there should be one more. Sorry. Um, here's one where it says make each one different. So I just made all the circles different and I also uh, blacked out the areas between the circles to have a more unified look. And this one says stitch lines, I haven't done that, so you'll see this spread some other time as well. And here's the last one, and the one I'm, I think I'm most content with for this flip through. It says turn things on the head, cut up a photo and transform it into an abstract composition. And I didn't use a photo, I used one of my old um, ink drawings. Um, took a photocopy of it and just cut it up. So this is a tawny owl or perhaps like three tawny owls and I just cut it up and pasted it in here and I think it looks rather cool. So this was the pages I have completed so far and um, as I said before I might add something to one of the or two of them. Uh, you might see them again but if you like this video and would like to see more anti journal videos and um, perhaps some in the other kind of style where I um, actually film when I finish a page or something. Leave a comment down below, um, give it a thumbs up if you like and please subscribe. Have a lovely day! Hey